So as we're all moving back into the workplace and spending more time in our communities, it's important to talk about the efficacy of different types of facial coverings. There's also been a little bit of misinformation on this topic in the media lately that we'd like to correct. Um, first, a plastic face shield is something that medical personnel wear to act as a barrier against splatter and splash events of um, the respiratory secretions from patients, particularly when they're having up close and sort of risky interactions. Those same medical personnel will also, however, wear an N95 respirator or a surgical mask, and that's to prevent the inhalation of virus from that patient. So your average member of the public does not need to wear um, a plastic face shield. There is no evidence that a plastic face shield will prevent that inhalation or exhalation of virus. And that makes sense because they're open to, uh, to the air underneath, right? What the public should do is wear uh, cloth face coverings. Now we know that these face coverings work best to prevent transmission of virus from the wearer to others in the community. There is some evidence that they prevent the inhalation of some large droplets for the wearer. So it's really important that everyone in the community wear a face mask for each other. Um, and if we do that, we'll find that uh, we see massive reductions in transmission in our communities.